He's up against Jonathan Bernier in the Red Wings. The Red Wings, with just nine wins this season, have fallen upon hard times, not unlike the mid-80s when Steve Eiserman arrived. Save right after that to settle things down. Justin Hall with a shot and a scramble in front of Jonathan Bernier off a faceoff. And so the Red Wings advance, and Hironik's trying to get to center. He advances the puck. Athens CU, rink wide. In comes Helm to Glendinning. What a save by Hutchinson. And the puck leaped through, and Justin Hall made sure that it didn't get to the goal line. Good hustle by Glendinning to cut that pass off. Athens CU walks in, stripped to the puck by Morgan Riley, and he's back the other way. Hyman straight up the middle. A breakaway for Zach Hyman. Cut from behind, runs into the goaltender. Penalty or penalty shot? A penalty on Mike Green coming back against Zach Hyman. Riley's got the bouncing puck, creates a turnover, but then watch his reaction. Does a nice job of turning it back over, creates that chance. Oh, that, that should be a penalty shot in my books. And they're taking a look here to this puck. Where did it go afterwards as Hyman went down? Did it go in the net first? This might be a goal. That's an own goal by the Red Wings. I think this is going to be a goal by Hyman. Watch how the puck, it doesn't go off Hyman, it goes off the skate, and I think this is going to be a goal. For the wing, Ernie drops the puck back, Mike Green is there. Hyman came towards him, Athanasiu centering pass, comes all the way back, a one-timer, and Hutchison read that well, and got across to stop Zadina on the pass from Mike Green. William Nylander. Mitch Marner picked his way through, made a nice play, and Tavares is in the attacking zone, centering, Matthew scores! Boy, there were a few great plays there, and Matthews was the finisher. A 2-0 lead with a power play goal for Toronto. This little play, just a subtle little stutter step, take the puck from the outside to the inside, and you've seen his entire career, Matthews reaches back for this one. It's not a one-timer shot. He had to reach back and look at right underneath the toe of Calvin Pickard there. Pickard had the stick on the five hole, but before he could get to a flat butterfly there, it went right underneath, and that's the quick release. They tried it again, and just about sprung Dylan Larkin up the middle. Here comes Hyman, had a look around, backhander scores! What a shot! And a big smile from Zach Hyman for his second of the night and a 3 0 lead. And if you saw that pile, another big smile was Hall. Matthews, patience in the middle, backhand up the slot. And how about this one? To the backhand, keeps it protected to the outside. Pickard goes down, and man, that's a perfect shot. Right off the bar and out. You couldn't place it any better. A backhand shot is a difficult one for a goaltender to read. To Hyman. Matthews goes to the net. Hyman. Two goals already in the game. Look for CeCe, then went back to Marner. To Matthews, he scores! How about this puck control? Hyman doesn't want to give it away, so he just stops up. Marner's got his head up the entire way to get the point for Matthews. And you know that if you can get open, Mitch Marner's going to find you. And here's Matthews. Everybody's puck watching. Red Wings get the draw. There's a hard one-timer. Athanasiu just wide of the net from Hironi. Here's Athanasiu again off the post score on the rebound. Tyler Bertuzzi right there to bury it. And the Red Wings won't be denied tonight. That's a power play goal, and it's a 4-1 game. He was slapping his stick down after this goal. I don't know if he didn't like the penalty shot, but it'll be interesting to see if the Red Wings get another power play here. Watch the pass by Fabry, just the... Quick little saucer pass off the post, but Bertuzzi's in position there, gets underneath on CeCe. Oh, well, geez. to see you. That took a run at Kerfoot, and he's going to get the needle eyes, and in comes Justin Hall. He gets thrown down by Athanasiu. Just a shocking ending to a non-emotional game that really had very little physical element to it. I was busy watching this one. Yeah.